we're not here for this thing although i think i do want to warm up on this because this thing looks sick get like a little line i'll leave the stairs a little something off the curb maybe so i have come back and applied a second coat of concrete sealer so this thing should be pretty nice once we wax it up at least we'll be able to like push a little crooked bonk or something but first I gotta change out my wheels because I'm rocking these really worn down classics, which like I said, is the optimal shape for me, but really it's just like basically a little radial. And uh, we got 93s for this ground because yeah, I'm not, trying to, I'm not trying to get rattled, you know what I mean? All right, so we're gonna swap these out for the 93 because this parking lot, as fun as it is, can be a little bit crusty. So uh, just make life easier, have a little cushion for the pushing, you know what I mean? All right, crust busters are on, so let's go ahead and warm up. I'm gonna skate this little manual pad here and then maybe like venture over, get a little ollie down that stair set, do something, a little manual thing. You know what I mean, just warm up. Also kind of waiting for these landscapers down here to move, so we've got a little bit of time to kill. this parking lot too much i usually just like go in skate the little ledge in there but seeing all this like cool little stuff here this is kind of like a weird natural quarter pipe out of this tree do a little axle stall or something this looks sick let's skate it man <laughs> I got sweaty playing on this thing. That was too much fun, dude. All right, before we go skate the little out ledge out there, uh, I wanted to get a little warm-up session in here, but dude, this place is looking crazy right now. I'm gonna go get the blower, clean up a little bit, and not skating here a whole lot. Just gonna get a little couple little warm-ups. You know what I gotta do? I gotta tail slide these ugly vertical marks away because I'm petty like that. Friendly reminder, if you guys are skating out in the sun, use sunscreen. Don't skip that shit. times how the fuck yeah admittedly that's not like a trick i would sit around and work on cleaning up it's just a little goof around thing i kind of got stuck on so we'll take it some wax and check it out so this dude alex hit me up on instagram and offered to send me some of this wax that he puts in deodorant sticks i was like shit cool man yeah slick pits uh so yeah i got this bigger one here and uh even sent me a little pocket one so i could wax the board which will be really nice but hey good time to test it out right now right and it looks pretty much just like deodorant let's see if it <laughs> that's pretty sick dude hey shout out alex thank you man let's butter this thing up real quick so i can try to get a tail slide here we go well that's 
certainly uh, went down pretty quick. Hopefully it lasts a while. We'll see. Oh. <laughs> Came out too soon. <laughs> Well, the wax works. Oh, shit. Yeah, wax works good, dude. Seems a little bit soft, though. Prefer it to be a little bit harder. Uh, I want to try to do. Uh, what would it be, a fakey back nose grind or a fakey switch 5.0 if you want to be wrong about it? We're going to do it on this little guy right here because I like skating this thing. And also, uh, I'm the one that started this little spot. And then we'll skate the new little off-ledge thing out there, but that's going to be for the end because I'm not sure how many tricks I even got on it or if it's going to grind, but we'll see. I think I have faith in it. But we got the grind. All right. Well, we made it. Any other day, I'd be like, dude, I'm done. My feet are hurting. My shoes, like, falling apart here. I mean, shout out to these shoes, though. These have lasted way longer than any other shoes I've been skating in. I uh, hope Adidas continues to make these because they're, like, my favorite slip-on. Okay, shoe review aside, let's fucking get this thing going, man. I don't really have too many tricks for it, to be honest, but we're going to try to at least get a little crooked grind today just for the hell of it. And like I said, I already treated this thing twice, so hopefully it has no issues just getting into a quick little grind. And as I'm saying that, security is right behind me. And I've never even seen security at this place, but there they are. So, all right, let's get to it. The wax just glided on so smooth. Like, I feel like this is just gonna grind right away. Hope I don't jinx it, but yeah, that looks pretty nice, man. I'm pretty tired today, so if I get the crooked grind, I'll be kind of happy with that. That was the tiniest bonk known to man. But honestly, that's like what it's all about, man. It's just like getting a little spot prepped up. I mean, and now other people can come here. Somebody can backtail it. Somebody can fucking front blunt it. I mean, there's a lot of possibilities just for like a quick little line, you know? Like it's an interesting spot, kind of reminiscent of like one of those spots you'd see on the East Coast, I feel like. I don't know, maybe it's just cause it's like brick and stuff, but it's a cool spot, man. And now it's going. It's more about just like conquering the spot. You know what I mean? It's about starting a spot, getting a spot going. Spot, spot, spot. Holy shit, I'm hot. I wonder if there's any way I can hit this side. I've eaten shit, like I've straight up slammed into this thing trying to ollie up this. So I don't know, I'm kind of scared of it, but. How much do you think this thing costs? Yeah, I guess we could do a, a ride up to Fakie. Let's, let's do it. Thank you guys for watching as always and uh hope it inspires you to go skate go find some goofy little thing in a parking lot and try to do a stall on it i don't know just go have fun make time to go skate when you can all right y'all see you on the next one peace we're abandoning all core principles